What's up guys? It's uh, Tennessee Country Boy over here in Memphis, Tennessee. Just got unloaded. Been kind of a messy day as you can tell. It's uh, a lot of rain and sleet and some ice. It's about gone now. It's pretty much just rain now. But it got, got kind of rough this morning. It uh, had some had some sleet and the trees were freezing up it was terrible it's uh, actually when i left jackson tennessee it was still sleeting a little bit and it's actually calmed down a little getting ready to head over here to the um head over here to the yard we have a yard over here at memphis tennessee and getting ready to head over here and pick up a load uh, going to counts tennessee to the uh paper mill over there uh, those loads are usually pretty heavy. I just brought a load of cardboard boxes to a place here in Memphis um, Over here off of Getwell, Getwell Road And hopefully it's going to be a fairly short day. I started about 6 a.m. this morning And it's uh, right now it seems like it's going to be a short day maybe I have to go pick this trailer up and carry it to counts and probably pick up a load of um, paper rolls and bring it back to Jackson, Tennessee where my yard is at. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. Uh, I'm going to add a little bit more to this later on today. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and comment. Uh, if you have any questions, please ask. Uh, I don't mind answering them. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Hit that like button. Thanks. What's up guys? Tennessee Country Boy here. Just got home from work about 45 minutes ago, an hour ago. Um, was walking around, thought I would do a little bit of recording. Uh, I was actually sitting here playing with my uh, iPhone 5S. I actually have straight talk, but uh, I found a 5S for a good price. And it's um, actually pretty neat. Uh, I've had the 5 and the 4S and the 4, but never had the 5S. So found one brand new in the box and for a good price out of that bat and that's it right there it's actually uh, it's actually a pretty good phone not bad at all really quick it um, it actually is really quick I think it's got like the a7 chip in it or whatever it actually works really good um, I wanted, I started started to get the 5C, but everybody's like, you know, get the 5S, get the 5S, so I did. Uh, didn't do a lot today. I had to take off work a little bit early. Got, um, had, had some things to do still with my dad. And um, got those done. Well, thought I got those done. Uh, one of them I couldn't do because what I went to do wasn't ready yet. So it's, um, going to be Monday or Tuesday before I get that done. But uh, right now, just sitting around chilling, doing nothing, uh, playing around on YouTube. Um, I ordered me a uh, one of those 10-foot, I think it's called a lightning, lightning cable for the iPhone 5 and 5S. And I just got in it in today, and I'm hoping to try it, and hopefully it works. It uh, wasn't very much, like 10 bucks or something. But um, I wanted it for my bedroom it, to charge my phone because the plug is so far from my phone that uh, the one that comes with it is way too short and I have to lay it in the floor. So I got a 10 foot so I can reach y'all across to my nightstand. But uh, it's brand new still in a package. I hope it works. Like I said, it wasn't but 10 bucks. But uh, thought I would get on here and share a little bit about my day. Started out this morning, went to Memphis, Tennessee and dropped off a load. Uh, sit there a little while, picked up uh, a, a few pallets from the same place and left and come back to the yard and come home. Um, stopped and got some gas. I'm not sure what you guys pay for gas where you live, but here uh, it was $3.09 a gallon, which I don't guess is bad because it was three forty fifty. dollars It was high. Um, it's and I think in some places it's still real high so I guess 309 is actually pretty good 
uh, it's I put it in a little Ford Ranger. I've got a little Ford Ranger that I drive, and it it does pretty good. It's got a 4.0 V6. It does pretty good on gas. Not the best, but it does pretty good. Uh, good enough, I guess. Uh, and I'm going to go this afternoon. Uh, probably in another couple of hours. It's like five minutes till two Central Time. So I'm probably going to go in a couple of hours uh, down to my dad's uh, place. And he has a shop, a actual uh, pretty good, sh pretty good size shop. And my dad's always been what I would call a hoarder. He kept, he keep or kept everything, uh, no matter what it was. If he thought he could ever use it, he kept it. So I'm gonna go down there and straighten up. And and my dad was a welder and a logger, and you know, and cut timber and stuff like that. So I'm gonna go down there and uh straighten up some stuff get some get it where you can actually walk in the shop move his four wheelers around and move some of his equipment and some of his tools and stuff like that and get it where you can actually walk inside he kept it cluttered but the thing is if you ever walked up and said you needed a something he would know exactly where it is he could tell you where to go or he could walk over and put his finger on it so i guess that's actually a good thing um i'm probably going to do that this afternoon uh and probably all day tomorrow and maybe even Sunday. I haven't made up my mind about Sunday yet, but uh, gonna do it all, definitely all day tomorrow. Uh, it's probably gonna take a couple of weekends to get it done because it is quite a bit of stuff. I'm gonna move it. He's got a big tractor shed up uh, up on the hill uh, at his place. So I'm gonna move a lot of that stuff up there, get it cleaned out, get it, you know, get the floor swept, get some of the metal up out of the floor, get some of the tractor parts up out of the floor, and I'm going to sort of straighten it up where you can actually find something, where I can find something. Now my dad knew where it was, but I don't. So I'm gonna go through it and look through it and, and see where everything's at, sort of organize it where I can, if I need something, I just walk in and know, you know pretty close to where it's at. That's probably gonna be an all day thing tomorrow, maybe even Sunday, probably gonna take a while. Uh, he has a lot of scrap metal and stuff like that. I may even care, end up carrying a couple loads of that off. Um, he kept everything. I mean, kept everything. He kept everything. He had, uh, if he thought he would ever have a use for it, he kept it. Especially if it was, you know, metal, uh, uh, metal material, something, something off of a car or something like that, he would keep it. Thought he would use it maybe someday or trade it for something or whatever. But I'm gonna go down there and do that. Uh, my first cousin's gonna go help me do that. Um, it's supposed to be kind of a pretty day tomorrow. I think it's supposed to like maybe sprinkle rain or something in the morning and then turn into uh, uh, turn into like, I think sunshine, I'm not real sure. Uh, it's supposed to be like 60 degrees or, or 58 degrees or 62 degrees or something. So I'm thinking that's gonna be a good day for that. At least I hope it's gonna be a good day. Uh, usually when I go down there for the last for the last couple of weeks or actually last couple of months it's been like cold so I'm hoping I get down there and don't have to wear like a real big coat and like right now it looks uh, it looks kind of dreary outside it rained pretty much all morning so and it's sort of uh, sort of cloudy now well you can look actually if the camera focus it'll I mean it's kind of cloudy not bad there's my little truck right there it's not bad so hopefully all the rain will be gone and I can get out there tomorrow and do something that's needed to be done forever it uh, needed to be done years ago, but my dad is like, like I said, a hoarder. And he thought if it was ever usable, that wouldn't no need to throw it away, you may need it. So that's what I'm gonna try to take care of tomorrow. Uh, just walked in my kid's room and it's actually sort of straight a little, well, not really, uh, a little bit, but not much, as you can tell. It's not that straight, it's okay. That's where all the business takes uh, takes place right there. <laughs> Them kids love that right there, boy. That right there, this um, toy box you see right here, my dad actually built that 
a couple years ago. Uh, he called me and he was like, you think the kids would like a toy box? And I was like, well, of course they would. Uh, took him about four or five months to build it. Of course, he never gets in no hurry. But anyway, he, he built it and brought it over to the house. I was like, look, I need you to help me unload it. So I got it unloaded and the kids went crazy. Here is the bunk beds. Uh, they, I, I actually built those. Um, I don't know, like, uh, 2012. Uh, they, this, the bunk beds, and the toy box that you see right there, uh, are actually were actually built from cedar, from red cedar, from my dad's place. Uh, he actually cut the trees down, and he actually cut the trees down off of his land, went, took them to a, uh, a friend of his that has a sawmill and had them sawed up and planed down. <clears throat> and we had, or we planed them down and then put them together. Took me about, I think it took me like two weekends in a row, uh, about 12 hours a day to finish those bunk beds. But I think they turned out pretty good and the kids love them. So as you can tell, they love them. And I don't really know why I built bunk beds because they, both of them sleep on the bottom one. Uh, the, my little girl and my little boy both sleep on the bottom. They play on top, sleep on the bottom. I'm not sure what that's all about. But anyway, that's what they do. I'm not carrying you to my bedroom because it is a mess. We'll go back in here to where the light is. There's the dog. That's Yeah, she's a sport rotten brat. Uh, there's the S3 that I was using before I got the 5S. I like the S3. It was actually pretty quick, and it was actually um, really quick as far as the internet goes, as far as 4G or whatever. But I just wanted something different, and I wanted to go back to Apple, so I bought an Apple iPad. I mean, an Apple iPhone 5S because I haven't had one in a while so I decided I'd buy one uh, I guess that's about it for today uh, leave a comment down below if you got any questions feel free to ask them uh, if you make sure to hit the like button subscribe to my channel uh, I'm getting a little bit slower I'm gonna try to get a little bit faster in recording these uh, vlogs it's kind of hard because of my work uh, at work, I try to do a little bit at work, but it's really hard to do because I'm constantly going and of course I can't record going down the highway. So, or I could, I guess. But I try not to record going down the highway and I usually record it when I'm sitting somewhere and I don't do a whole lot of sitting, so it's really hard to do. Most of mine is done when I get home. Um, and I try to do it when I'm here by myself because my kids are really loud and I would have to like scream, so. I just do it when I'm here by myself. Uh, anyway, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more vlogs. Don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. If you got any comments, feel free to leave them. Have a good day.